I don't know where this bear is. I'm excited for him to come like bounding through this door at any moment. I really don't know where he is. There he is. Hi, Mr. Bear. Hi, Mr. Bear. Woo! Okay. Oh god, that hurt. That hurt. Okay. Um, close this door. Close that door there. Right. Okay. I think he's probably gonna try and come through this door. Okay, there we go. So the, zo the zombie bear is here. I think he's. I think he's stuck here. Okay. Here. We go. Oh god. I'm sorry, Mr. Bear. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mr. Bear. I'm sorry. Greetings, everybody, and welcome to Let's Play 7 Days to Die Alpha 17. Oh god, the soldiers are already attacking me. We are now on episode 39 of our holiday series, guys. So in the last episode, we went ahead and redid the uh, Shotgun Messiah factory. And I still have a couple of uh, Vulture Sleepers to go ahead and clear out. And as you can see, they're kind of all, like, caught up here. Um, and they can't really uh, get to me right now, I guess. So um, they're, they're kind of, like, passing around here. But we need to kill these last ones um, in order for it to actually register for the quest complete, which is kind of... It's kind of weird, but yeah, the vulture sleepers uh, do actually count. Now, I think if I take if I take this off, I'm not gonna be able to see a thing. So I need to kind of wait for them to come to me, um, and see if they want to see if they want to come down here. Let's see if I can get to a place where they will be more inclined to attack me. Maybe over here they'll come. They'll come over here. So yeah, as you can see, they're kind of like in this area right here, and I can't. Oh, there we go. There's one of them. Yeah, I, I can't get these guys until they attack me. Um, which is the main problem. Now I think there's some. Is there some outside here? There might be. There might be one in this section as well. I'm not too sure. Uh, but yeah, for some reason the vultures want it inside, and they are having. They're having some issues, guys. I mean, they have it. They're, there's. They're having all kinds of clipping problems and everything. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make some uh, or use these wood frames that I've got here though. Uh, we're gonna see if we can kind of use these to get a bit of a get a bit of a way up to. There's there's like a hole in the wall there that I never noticed before. So I'm going to use this to kind of come out here. Just have a bit of a, just have a bit of a look. What is through here? I wonder. Seems it drops down. Okay, it just drops down to here. There's nothing really, nothing really special there. So let's see if I can spot this bird. See where it is. Um, there it is. He's over there somewhere. Yeah, I see him. He's over here. See, so yeah, I need to, I need to go ahead and kill this bird to actually complete the quest. Right, hang on. He's gone over here now. So I try to, try, try to spot a really annoying fly. Um, but yeah, there's there there he is over there. He's he's really struggling to to get to where I am. Like he is, oh, nearly got him. I got I gotta kind of like wait for him to come in here and see if I can see if I can kill it. Um, but he is uh, he is not too happy. This guy, this bird is really not happy. He is flapping about all over the shop, and he just doesn't know where to go. Bless him. Look at this thing. Oh, there we go. We need to go. Yeah, you got you gotta be so precise with this as well. But yeah, he's flying backwards. He's flying backwards. Oh, I nearly got him. Nearly got him. Just try to just try to get him when he comes to this region. This is probably the best place that I can stand to be able to get to him. I hear a bear outside as well. Um, and then once we got this one, there's one more somewhere as well that I don't know where he is. Okay, uh, if he stays there, there you go. Got another one. There you go. Got him. So yeah, got it. Got him in the dark. So there's that one. Apparently, there's one on the same level as me right here as well. Mm, there, there is a person up here. Um, okay, so anything else up here? How do I usually get up here? Oh, there's a, there's a way up here. I didn't even notice like this little um this little area up here. So where's this last one? There's one there's one more somewhere. And I think I think he's either in here or on the roof. Gotta follow the flapping wing noises. Okay, uh, maybe he's through here. Ah, I think he's, I think he, I think this one might be outside actually. Yeah, he is. He's out here. I think. Well, I hear him. I hear him, but I don't see him. There he is. I think this might be the last one. He might be the last one. Hang on. Got him. Nice, and that's it. Place clear. There we go. So there's the last vault is done. And now the only other, the only other little problem we have, the, the slight little niggle that we now have, is that there is a lovely zombie bear outside waiting to eat us, which is you know, never, never good. Um, I could probably drop down here though and kind of. I probably like drop down here and get off the roof from here. Yeah, there's, it's pretty easy to drop out. Um, now I did have a um, sprained leg, but I think that's all healed up now, which is good. So if I drop down here, then down to here, and then out of here. Deadly sounds like the bear is in the building. Um, so hopefully he's not going to come after me. I mean, I can try and find where he is to kill him, but you know what? Let's go and find the bear. Let's, yeah, let's, let's let's try and find Mr. Bear because Mr. Bear is here somewhere. So where is Mr. Bear? 
Let's see if we can find him. It sounds like he's down here. Oh, Mr. Bear. Where are you, Mr. Bear? Okay. Okay, he's to my left. I think he's through there. Okay. There's one guy here. Right, we got him. Okay, you may bleed. God damn it. Right. Right, so he's there. Right, where is the bear, though? That's the real question. Where is Mr. Bear? Okay. I hear him. Where is he? Hello? Okay, he's really quiet. I don't know where he is. I don't know where this bear is. I'm expecting him to come, like, bounding through this door at any moment. I really don't know where he is. There he is! Hi, Mr. Bear! Hi, Mr. Bear! Woo! Okay. Oh, God, that hurt. That hurt. Okay. Um, close this door. Close that door there. Right, okay. I think he's probably going to try and come through this door. Okay, there we go. So the, zo the zombie bear is here. I think he's... I think he's stuck here. Okay, here we go. Oh god, I'm sorry, Mr. Bear, I'm sorry! I'm sorry, Mr. Bear, I'm sorry! Okay, run, 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 run. Okay, he's on fire, he's on fire. Um, okay. Save from his car here. Alright, I'll try and melee a zombie bear, see if we can do it. Right, hi, Mr. Bear! I'm sorry, Mr. Bear, I'm sorry! Right, let's kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Okay, I don't think he can get out here. Yes! We got him! Nice! One dead zombie bear. 880 XP. That's actually not that much for killing a zombie bear. You would you would think you would get a lot more for that, but but no. But there we go, guys. This is now this quest all done and done. So we are now ready to go ahead and uh, head on out of here and head back to the trader once again. So there we go. That's the uh, that's finally that clear quest done. So hopefully we're going to find a nice reward from the uh, we're going to find a nice reward from the trader uh, for completing that one. So I'm going to go ahead and drive back. Um, probably like drop some stuff off back at base first, and then once I get back. Uh, and we're ready to continue. I will meet you guys. Uh, I'll meet you guys then, and we can see what reward we're going to get from the trader for completing this tier five quest. All right, guys. I am back at the uh, main little base that we have going on now. One thing I want to do before we go ahead and go to the trader is we did have the itsy bitsy spider challenge to go ahead and do. So we're going to go ahead and read this one. So a strange note that I found while looting is from the Crazy Jake clan. Let's see what this one says, shall we? Hey, jackass! If you read this note, it should come as no surprise that we've been sizing you up. I got just the test for a simpleton like you. Do it, and we might take you in. Crazy as never, Jake. Challenge is to kill some spider zombies. All right, let's go ahead and do that. We've been seeing a lot of spider zombies recently, so yeah, this shouldn't be uh, too hard to pull off. Um, where is the challenge point? Um, okay, that's actually not too far down south. Um, now we're gonna go to the um, we're gonna go to the trader first. Hand in the uh, we're gonna hand in the the quest that we have going. Uh, let's try not to uh, destroy part of our own building as well. That would also be uh, you know not destroying our own building is uh, also a very very handy uh, a very very handy thing. But we're going to go back to the trader first. We're going to see if he's got any other quests. Because I want to see if he'll uncover the other factories for us now that we got the tier 5. Um, and I'm wondering if there's like any um, of the Higashi pharmaceutical buildings or the Dishong Towers or anything on this map as well. Because I know that I have seen some skys skyscrapers in random gen. But I don't know if my random gen in particular actually has any. Because it looks like it's... Um, in my opinion, it looks like it's not really generating that much variety of buildings. I'm not really seeing that much unique stuff in each town. It looks like it's just like the same town copied and pasted over and over with a couple of minor variants. But let's go ahead and hand this guy in. Sell only the best merchandise. Well, that's good, but I want a reward. You've made my day. And here is your payment. Hmm. Okay, so you got a common bow to five, which does sell for quite a bit. You've got a... Iron boots, or you got this. Okay, looks like the combine bow tier five is probably the best thing I can take. Yeah, I'll take the I'll take the combine bow tier five. Thank you very much. Let's go and complete that one. Nice. And do you have any other jobs that I can take? Let's see. Um, so he's got a. So there's loads of tier five ones here. There's a hidden. I just want to see where these are. Um, that's another. Right, that's another shotgun Messiah factory, so let's decline that one. Um, that's a hidden cache. I mean, that one we just need to go ahead and try and find the cache. Um, you know what, we might accept that, but let's go and see what well, the other ones are. Alright, how about this one? That's an apartment one, I don't want that one. Well, uh, any other jobs? Fetch and clear. In here? Will you kindly help me um, yeah, so the, the only, the only, see, the only big POIs it seems that we have are the big factories. So let's go ahead and do this one 5.4k away. Let's take that one. There you go, we'll take that one for you. No worries. And see your inventory. Let's go and sell some stuff then. So yeah, before he keeps uh, yapping on, let me sell the compound bow to you. Sell this, sell this. Um, this can go, so it can... 
Okay, these can't. There's a tier 6 shotgun there. We can sell that. 2400. You can have all this stuff here as well. And you may take this and this and this. And this with a lot. Nice. And we have three skill points to spend. So very close to being able to get strength nine, which is going to be really, really handy. Um, okay, that's everything I can sell to you, isn't it, at this current point in time? Uh, I think so. There's nothing else I really want to get rid of. Um, well, you buy the sign in tens for three. All right, well, I'll, I'll, I'll give you that one up. And let's try that. Oh, actually, I need to repair this glove. Oops, never mind. Um, so let's see what he actually has on him. In terms of um, mods, what do you have? Uh Military plating, rod and string replacement, uh, shotgun choke, nothing good there. Let's just have a look and see if he's got any decent, if he's got any decent mods. Oh, he's got some steel boots though. That's not bad. Um, our rating is 9. That's not bad. That's not bad. It's going to cost me 10k, but that's pretty good. So steel boots could be a thing. Uh, let's see what else you got. You got solar cells. You've got, okay, now, now you're selling steel. God damn it. Now I can make it. Now you're selling it. Um, do you sell any more 762 rounds as well? I just want to double check. Uh, 762s would be under here if anywhere, wouldn't it? Uh, looks like you don't. Yeah, he, he has no no extra stuff. Okay, um, let me go and take the steel boots, I think. Because um, that's probably better than mine. Thanks so I will take that. Come again. And we are currently wearing... So what's better? So military boots give a pl give an arm rating of that much. Steel gives a 9. Okay, so I don't know if military boots is light armor or heavy armor then. I'm guessing military is actually light armor. Um, okay, well, let's go and take these then. And we're going to go and modify these. And we're going to take off the dies. And then we're going to go and wear this one. Or modify this first. And then we're going to add these to it as well. So you can have that. And the customized fittings. There we go. And then we can sell this military one back to him. So see your inventory. And you may have military boots. There you go. And you may you may have these back. That's fine. Uh, give, give me my money. I'll take those take those coins back from you. Thank you very much, Mr. Trader. And Peace then be with you, my friend. I'll wear these ones. There we go. So that's better. So standard protection is minus 0.9. Mobility is a little bit better, though. Um, but there you go. We can wear those now. I know I should be good with uh, steel boots. See, I'm not sure if military is light or heavy, but we need to. There's also some stuff we need to repair here as well. Like we are, we're suffering. Uh, let's have a look and see your inventory a second as well. Do you have? Do you have just for convenience? You haven't had forged iron on you. Like every other day, I've seen you have forged iron on you. You do. So let's get a couple of these. Um, and I want to go ahead and grab the the vest he had. Um, gonna cost me a little bit, but that's fine. Because then I can scrap that. Check back soon. I get new merchandise daily. And then we can go and repair the iron armor here. So I want to repair that. I want to repair my helmet as well. So yeah, we, we want to repair all this if we can. Um, so that's fine. So we can get our armor repaired up. And while that's scrapping, let's go ahead and move to the second trader. Oh, of course, let's uh, check his vending machine as well. See if he's got anything good in there. He has gone or tea and canned food. That's pretty much it. Nothing great. All right, let's move on to the other one. And then I guess we'll do the Itsy Bitsy Spider Challenge and then move on from there. So let's go ahead and make our way to Mr. Trader number two. So good having this bike, though. So good having this bike. Very soon, I think, we'll be able to get the 4x4 as well. That's going to be awesome. I'm not too worried about the gyrocopter because I think that's just really... I think the gyrocopter is just really slow. So I'm not too worried about that. I mean, the gyrocopter would be great for getting to the top of factories just to get the loot. That would be where it shines. But other than that, it's like... The bike is faster. Um, so... The point of the gyrocopter is, I guess, just to get a view of the map, but other than that, it's not really not really that good. Okay. But then again, you know, maybe maybe the gyrocopter's been made for... I, I remember when I tried it, the gyrocopter was really slow. So maybe it's been made faster now. I have no idea. Right. Hello. All right. Any jobs for you as well? Um, hidden cache and clear. Fetch and clear. Okay. Clear zombies. Hidden cache. Let's see what each of these are. I could really use some help. That's an apartment Thank brick. You. Sixth floor. Oh, I didn't want to take that one. I did not want to accept that one. Hang on. Um, hang on. Tier 5, clear. That's the one that's 1k away. I didn't want to do that one. Um, so let's go and cancel that quest there. Hang on. No! Wait a minute. Right. Quest. I didn't want to take that one. Uh, let's get rid of you. There you go. Right. You can come out of here. Uh, let's try this again. Jobs. Um, this one? What's this one? Apartment break 6th floor? Nope. See what I mean? It's like, it's all the same, it's all the same jobs, unfortunately. Uh, hidden cash and clear. Apartment again. Nope. Uh, how about this one? 2.6? Nope. Again. Would you consider helping me? And another hidden cash here. Think you can help Factory Lighter too. Problem. It's the same, same one. Yeah, some of us uh, supplies are missing. Uh, some supplies. Yeah, so again, it's the same. So, 
I guess we'll accept the factory because that's more that's more beneficial. But still, I, I I'm gonna have to do this off camera. I think just to just to see if I can get rid of this. Um, just to, just to see if I can route through these to get through the tier five ones because there's not really that much else. It's rare to find. So I'll accept that. I guess. In these dark times. All right. Well, let's go and sell some stuff to him anyway. Um. So you may have. Um. Okay. You don't take the crossbow bolts. So I'll get rid of these if I can. You don't want those? Oh, fine, fine, don't. Don't take them then. Be be stingy like that. Stupid, stupid trader. Um, right, is there anything else he has on him that I can take? Let me always check for always check for ammo. Just in case. Uh he's got steel ammo. That's about it. I think that's the SMG we sold to him. Quality six hundred rifle in there, not bad. Um uh, modifications, what have you got for mods? You've got structural brace, bunker buster, mitch plating. This is the stuff I think I sold to him already. Yeah, I, I remember saying this. And in his hidden stash, what has he got in here? Uh, anything? He got plastic plating. <laughs> plastic plating, eh? Uh, that gives plus two arm rating. I'm guessing that's for... I guess that's for light armor. Let me see. Uh, can we be installed in light armor? Yeah, plastic plating's for light armor. Anything else in here that he's got? He's got more shotgun shells and steel arrows, I guess. But really, not that much good stuff, has he? No, it's a shame. That is a shame. Yeah, he really doesn't have any uh, any good stuff. Savage Operations Magazine. Hmm. Yeah, the, the trailer stock is rather disappointing at this point in the game. Structural Brace, we've already got one of those. Um, that just increases um, increases durability on a melee weapon. Or yeah, that's that's fine. We don't need that. Uh, same with the Bunker Buster, we don't need those. Yes, unfortunately, he doesn't really have that much good stuff on him either. Huh. Gratitude and safe travel, okay, well, you know what? Let's just drop those. <laughs> get, let's just get rid of the combat bows then. Don't need those. Now I can repair my armor as well. So we can come to this guy and we can repair it. Then we can come to this guy and we can repair it as well. There we go. So now my armor rating should be back to full durability again. Okay. So I think it's sending me back again to that same that same old factory again. I think it's sending me back to for the last tier five. Yeah, again, it's sending me back there. See, I don't want to go there. I've literally just been there. I want, I want something else. Um, Hang on. Where's the other one? The other one's the southwest. Um, Have I ventured down this way before? Um, that's kind of like at the corner of the map, I think. Let me see. Hmm. I'm just trying to see, because I want to see if there's any other, like... I honestly don't think there's any other, like, factories or anything. Because this is the southern side of the map here. That's, like, the northern side of the map here. So, yeah, we've we've explored so much of the map already. Like, there's a lot of it that's been explored, and there's just not much... There's not much in terms of looting opportunities anymore, which is kind of a sucky thing. Um, okay, let me find... Let me get to, where's this other quest? I want to see where it is in relation to where we are. Uh, let's go and show that on the map. So that is, let me come this way a bit. So that is, okay, that's actually pretty far south. We haven't actually explored down there yet. So maybe that's going to be along this road. I'm going to have to go ahead and skip and see what I can find. But first of all, before we do that, let's go ahead and make our way to the uh, to the spider challenge and see if we can complete that one at least, just to, uh, just to get that one knocked off. Now, I don't know if it's going to give us normal spiders or radiator spiders or what it's going to give us, but let's have a look and see if we can find anything anything useful. It'll give us some more experience as well, which is always handy. But we did level up, and in one more level's time, I can get strength 9. Then I think we need another 5 levels for strength 10. So I guess clearing these big buildings, although it is uh, tedious, at least it gives you a load of levels, which is, uh, which is a handy thing. So let's go ahead and make our way down here then and find where these spiders are resting. Yeah, at this point, I don't know if like the challenges like level up with you as well. So like at this point, it might give me like radiator spiders or something instead of just regular ones. I'm not sure. So okay, that's uh, that's not how to drive a motorbike. Okay, let's go this way then and have a look. So I think it's just down here. That we're gonna find it. Okay, drop through here and come up here. There we go. Yes, yeah, so this motorbike is definitely better at getting over terrain. It's really really good for that. Okay, so here we go. I think it's over here. So come around here. I think we've got to go up this road and then down here. Here we go. All right, so it's somewhere over here. Where's the where's the jumping exclamation mark point thingy? There it is. Right. Okay. Let's go and park our bike kind of outside the region of the quest. All right. Let's see what we got going on here, shall we? So time to go ahead and kill some spiders. Well, first of all, it's Lumberjack, because he is, uh, he's asking for it. There you go, you can have that. All right, spider time. Here we go. Right, so we're getting normal or radiated ones. Looks like we're just getting some normal ones. Okay. All right, there's one. 
two. Okay, oh, there's loads of them here. All right, come on. All right, don't you start. Right, we can... There's two. There's three. Let's get rid of all these guys. There you go. Is that it? That's it. There you go. Quest complete. That was pretty easy. So spiders are down. Give me a little bit of XP, but there we go. That's all I wanted to do. Just complete the quest and see how we could go there. Let's go ahead and make our way on here then. And we're going to go ahead now and head to... Let's see. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and head to this uh, this next quest location then. Because I want to see, maybe there's some other factories or other interesting buildings that we haven't looted yet. So although I'm going to head over here, my hope is that we're going to find actually something different rather than having to do, you know, another factory and another factory and another factory. Because, I mean, I love the factories and I love the apartments. I think they're awesome. But... I really hope they have more skyscrapers or something. I don't know if there's, I don't know if we can get to tier six quests or anything like that. We're, we're gonna have to complete a few of these, um, and I might have to complete some off camera just to see if we can, just to see if we can level up our trading tiers and stuff. So what I might do is, um, I know some of you guys said you don't like speed ups, and some of you guys said you do like speed ups. So I don't know whether I showed the exact same thing three times on camera though is something that I wanna be kind of mindful of because I mean it's it literally just on the farm, just on the shotgun messiah factory again so i don't know if i want to show the same thing three times in a row so that, that's the thing it's a bit of a dilemma that i'm currently facing but then again i do need to record a load of episodes for you guys anyway because as you guys know i will uh, at, at the current point um that you're watching this video i'm in the us so i can't really um i can't really really pull your opinion on like comments and stuff around that so i can i guess i just had to kind of have to think about it and make the best call um, and I think the best call right now is for me to maybe clear some of these off camera. Um, maybe record it, but and so if I die, you'll get to see it. But if not, then you know it's just assume like we get we get it cleared. And maybe I'll go ahead and like show you, show what loot I got and you know when I leveled up and things like that. Maybe that maybe that could be what I do. That could be what I do. So I'll show the looting part of it, but then like the clearing part where it's just you know kill a zombie, kill another zombie, kill another zombie. I might go ahead and just cut that bit out so you guys just get to see like the other the other kind of loot that we managed to find. But yeah, it seems the loot tables. It's the the one the one gaping flaw this thing has. Um, oh, and I'm in the water. Oh dear, I'm in the water. That's bad. Okay, yeah, we're underwater. But yeah, the one the one gaping flaw this has is the loot tables are very predictable now. Um, okay, I hope we can get out of this water. We're just gonna drive and hope for the best. Uh, but yeah, my my mini bike's not looking or my motorbike's not looking too good on gas right now. Okay, hopefully I'm not going to drown under here. Okay, come on. Come on, get out of the water. Now, there is a bug where you can kind of breathe above the water like that. And then go back under. So, yeah, there, there, that is a bug. But that's fine. Right, there we go. We're, we're out of the water. Oh, man, that was that was painful. Okay, now you just got to get out of it. Yes, yeah, so, sometimes these mountains can be a bit tedious. Um, right, come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. There you go, we're out. Good. Right. So yeah, let me go ahead and cut out to where the uh, to where the next town is. If I see anything interesting, of course, I'll go. I'll come and join you guys there, just so we can see what uh, what else there is to see. But for now, let's go ahead and uh, do a little bit of a cut. Oh, we're going into wasteland. Yay! Always, always fun. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, cut out a little bit, and I'll be back in just a bit. Alrighty, guys. Well, I found a new town, and it looks like there is in this place a, uh, a couple of cool POIs here. Now, one of them that I did see was a, uh, a Joe Bros building site, which we haven't actually done in the series yet. So I thought it could be pretty fun to go ahead and uh, maybe try out uh, one of those and see what has changed in the uh, in the most recent alpha for the uh, building site POI. Now, there's a couple of good places around here. You can see there's like some army camps and stuff around, uh, but I think the building site was. I think the building site, yeah, it was over here, look. So there's a building site over there. I'm just kind of having a little explore of this town uh, to see what else there is. So it is a desert town, which is pretty good. But I'm just trying to have a look and see if there's any other cool things that we could potentially uh, do. Still haven't found a skyscraper, but at least it looks like some of the old skyscrapers do appear uh, from previous alphas, which is really, really good. So I'm definitely happy with that. I also found an ostrich hotel as well. So it looks like some of the old buildings maybe appear in the desert biome only. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure, like, what their conditions are for appearing or, you know, how exactly the spawning of the, some of these buildings actually works. But, yeah, there is um, there is this little place here. There's a vulture after me. I'm going to keep driving. Uh, there is these, uh, this little town here, which has quite a, quite a bit of good stuff in there. There's uh, some apartments as well uh, that I managed to spot. And there's a bit of wasteland here. And now we're going back in the forest. I'm just trying to have a look and see what else is here. It looks like there's a, a massive house over here as well that I've not seen uh, before. 
Let's have a look. I'm not sure. Is this the hound? I want to check this house. Is this the old Victorian one that we've done before? With the it has the drop straight in. Oh no, no, we have done this one. Okay, that's um that's the one we have done before. So I won't go ahead and show that one again. We, we've already, you know, if we if we've already done it, there's no point me uh, there's no point me showcasing the same house twice almost in a row, right? So I won't go and do that one. But I just want to see like what's around this town and see if any uh, see if any good stuff is still still about. And it looks like there is a couple of good things, which is really really nice. Um, so yeah, I'm just kind of having a bit of a drive around. Just to see, you know, just to see what's here, you know. But it looks like, yeah, we're mainly in a... There's a desert area, so that means we can, as well, while we're here, probably collect aloe. Because we're definitely going to need that for healing bandages. Because I do eventually want to start getting those. Because I think our regular bandages just are not cutting it anymore. Um, and some healing ones are going to be... Uh, some healing ones are going to be appreciated. But I think what we'll do, then, is we're going to make our way to the builder's place. And we're going to go ahead and see if we can... We're gonna go and see if we can uh, hit this place up and see what we can find up there. Cause I know there's like a munitions box and a couple of good, uh, couple of good things up there. So I don't know if we're gonna find any anything interesting or not. So there's another apartment six floor there. We've we've already done two of those, so I'm not gonna do a third one. Uh, but there's also the ostrich hotel here as well. So there's a couple of good things. I think there's a massive post office here as well. So this place could potentially provide some good loot for us. So why don't we go and hit up this place first? Cause yeah, it's been a while since I've been to this place, and it'll be uh, it'll be nice to have a look in here. All right. Let's go and slow down here, and in we go. Right, so it looks like they've uh, made the entrance a bit more simple, and they've even added a uh, smoke mixer and stuff down here that might potentially be working, which is actually pretty cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and have a look through here, see what we can find. So there could be some builders, and, you know, fer ferals are going to be a thing, I think, so we're going to have to be a little bit careful here. Now, sometimes they spawn around the bottom, like this one right here. Let's go ahead and finish these guys off. You drop the bag, I'll have a look in a minute. Right, let's get you down as well. Right, what's in this bag? Anything good? Oh, herb antibiotics and uh, some casino coins. Very nice. How'd you get me on the way down? I don't know, but let's go and kill this guy. It's probably this guy, actually, that got me from behind. Okay. Oh, okay, there's loads of them here. Okay, loads of them have woken up. Okay, none of them feral yet, though. Right, you can drop down. You can drop down. Come on. There we go. Right, is that it? And there's another one here. So no ferals yet. Ow, don't you hit me. No ferals just yet, so that's a good thing. So let's go and keep looking. Right, so this guy... Right, so you are regular. Yeah, these guys are just regular ones, which is fine. I'm not too worried if they if they are feral, it's not too bad. There you go, and last one. Got him. There you go. So yeah, this uh, this uh, bat is doing me very, very good. Um, although it's nearly run out of your ability, so I need some iron. And to get that, let's go ahead and just go this, and then we'll give it a quick repair. There we go. That should help me a bit. Okay, we're gonna need more durability than that. We're gonna need more durability than that, you fool! Okay, let's go and just hack this up then, and then we'll give it a proper repair. There you go. That should do it. Now I'll give it a bit more of a repair, and I don't want the... For some reason I got a snowball, I don't want it. There you go, that'll do. As long as we got something here... Oh. Skater Punk dude there. You dead? Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, Skater Punk dude right there. Don't really want to deal with him. So I wonder if there's still, like, strippers in this place. Bikers and strippers. Seems like... Oh, this guy's a feral. So we do have ferals here. So let's go and uh, get this guy out. There we go, jump over here. Right, let's keep going this way. Come on, then, you. Right, oh, this guy is feral as well. Skater Punk dude is feral. Got him. And then the builder. Right, come on, then. Right, this guy's dead. There you go. And don't you dare break that car, come on. There you go. Knock you out, and this one. Got him. There you go. So what's flashing here? Oh, this is the flat. This is a flashlight that's flashing. Can I get rid of this? This is really annoying. Get out of it. There you go. Stupid, stupid flashlight. Right, let's go up here. All right, so let's go ahead and make our way up here. So there is some boxes here. So it's like this is mainly similar to what it was, although they've now made like some actual radar dish um, units and stuff like that as well. That's pretty cool. So they've kind of um, they kind of taken what they, like the old block shapes and they made like new ones and stuff from there as well, which is actually a really nice touch. Okay. So okay, a little bit has changed here. Not much, but a little bit. Let's have a look. Right, here we go. So I guess this place will be full of like pallets and boxes and things. Okay, they made this bit a one-way section only. Okay. Interesting. So you can now no longer go two ways. It is one way only here. They've added some like table saws and stuff. They've added like quite a few cool things here. Oh, okay, so now you got to jump up on here. And jump over here. Ah, okay, that's cool. Right, so there is a builder here. Right, let's go and deal with that guy first. There we go. There you go, try and knock some of these guys down. Just keep whacking until we get them. Right, knock them down. Right. 
Right, come on, you. you get you down as well. You got him. So much fire! There we go. Right, those guys are down as well. Right, let's keep going. Right, any more around this side? Uh, oh, take that up before he blows it up. And blows me up with it. There we go. Right, a couple of boxes here as well. Let's have a look and see what we get in here. Got some a sofa. We also got a fridge with some iron arrowheads in it. Not too worried about that. Okay. Oh, this guy um, fell down there. Hang on. There you go. Should be able to knock him out. Come on. Got him. There you go. Oh, and off, off the side he goes. That was awesome. Okay. We ready? Make sure my stamina is recovered before I before I make the jump. Let's make sure my stamina is at full. Yeah, it is. Okay, here we go. Oh, wait. I was still ducked. Okay, there we go. Okay, I was lucky. Save, save myself there. That was lucky. Right, is there any builders behind here? Nope. There's a, oh, there's a first behind here now. Okay. What we got in here? Uh, water, crossbow bolts. I guess I will probably drink the water now because we probably need it. Yep, we do. We're in the desert by him, so there's a few things you probably do need. Right, what's in there? We have jars. Not worried about those, really. And here we have more jars and cans. Again, not too worried about them. All right, so now we go up the ladder here. Okay. Oh, okay. It looks like we're going to have some birds. Get out of here. Okay. So bird sleepers seem to be a thing up here. Okay. Oh, you bugger. I hate when they kind of feign, feign attack you and then then they do a real one and you don't hit them. That's, that's the annoying thing when they do that. That's so annoying when they do that. Okay, here we go. Here's another one. Go on then. He's out. Very good. Stupid birds. And they probably infected me as well. God damn it. Uh, oh, canned food right there. I'll take that. Just help my hydration a bit. Let's go and scrap that. We can then use that to repair our club. And let us proceed to a high level. Okay. So we have ooh, a feral builder right here. So let's knock him out. There we go. He's out. Oh, and we can jump over your head. There we go. Oh, okay. So we've got a couple of ferals here, I think. Um, right, this guy's feral. There we go. Ow. How dare you. Get out of here. Right, there we go. Kill you. There we go. One. Kill this one. Kill it! Kill it! Two. And three. There we go. Alright, how are we doing here? Right, those guys are dead now. Those guys are dead. And uh, anyone here? Nope. Okay, let's open these. So there is a box there, which has nails and paint. I'll just take the nails. Not worry about the paint, though. Uh, let's see what we've got over here. Right, anyone here? <laughs> Death! That's, that, that's who's over here. It's like, oh, hey, Death. How you doing? Right, let's come up here. Right, anyone around here? Probably going to be run, running at me from here somewhere. No? Okay. Oh, there's a bag binder now. Nice. What have we got in here? Uh, oh, some uh, some decent armor from the bag. Not bad. Oh, hello. How you doing? Right, it's not these guys back. One. Two. There you go. Oh, and off he goes. Love it. I love it when they like ride it off the edge. That's always really fun to watch. Right. That's a toilet. Nothing good in it. There you go. Let's get both these guys out of the way. Nice. You dead? Yeah, you're dead. Okay. It, 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 I, don't, I wasn't quite sure if he's dead. He didn't make, it, didn't make any noise. So I was like, hmm. Are you dead or are you not dead? Okay, let's walk along here because one of the builders has already broken off that bit. Right, any more behind here? Nope. There is a bag right here. Let's have a look in here. Okay, nothing much there. Right, so now we're going to go up again. Alright, so making progress up here. We are getting... We are super overheated right here as well. Oh, why can't I not move? Okay, I was stuck behind... Oh, there's a box there now. Okay. I've always been used to just being able to walk around there. But yeah, the uh, the overheating effects is going to be... Uh, is going to drain me quite a lot here. Because uh, it is desert by him, so... Unfortunately, I have no poncho. I'll take that, though. But that is okay. Um... Okay, let's jump up here. But yeah, now being uh, now being exposed in the open is where the problems come. So there's another working cement mixer right there. Nice. Okay, so I wonder if there's still a landmine on this crane. Yeah, there is. There's still still a landmine right there. Look. Let's go ahead and take that out. Oh, okay, that that destroys the entire thing now. Oh, sneaky buggers. So the landmine is it was used to hold this whole thing on. Sneaky buggers. Damn. Okay. Okay, so we got a bird up here. Get rid of you. Wow. Okay, I didn't I didn't realize that they changed that now so the landmines like held it all together. 
That is very sneaky. Right, there's some nuisance box down here. We should go and grab that. There's, uh, there's probably some more sleepers up there. This is like the last little bit. But yeah, that's very sneaky. That's very, very sneaky indeed. Alright, let's have a look in here. So, munitions box. Do you have anything? Can I even can I even get down there? I just got a thousand health. Okay, let's just break this out. Let's break this one. There you go, so I can jump on that and then jump in. Here we go. Right, what have we got in here? Uh, why don't I, like, stand up and then do it? Because that'll be quicker. <laughs> Instead of taking, like, 12 seconds, it'll take 8. So, yeah, a little bit quicker. Because these things always take ages to open. Like, ages to open. So, yeah. Let's see what we got here. 762 in rounds. Kind of better, but there you go. What can you do? Um, Alright, so here we go. We're going to have to go over here. Probably going to find, like, rads and stuff here. So, got to be a little bit careful. Right, let's get the bar so I can be a bit more... Oh, yep, there's a rad right there already. Good. There we go. Oh, and a rad army dude here as well. Okay. Okay. Oh god. Okay. Already got a couple of rads coming in here, so might need to uh, might need to get out the old shotgun. Okay. And a and a, and a white. Okay. Got rat rat rads and whites coming in here. Okay. Try and get some of these guys out. Luckily, we got the we got the rad remover here, so that that's gonna be handy. Okay. Lots of uh, lots of nasties up here. Go and get this one. Oh, okay, watch out for you. Ouch. Okay, need to reload. Oh god, okay. It's bad, we need to reload here. Right. Get some of you guys down. Okay. Okay, don't get surrounded. Don't get surrounded. Run through this way. Okay, run back. Right, come back this way. Make sure we don't get strafed. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we want to make sure they uh, don't strafe. Oh, okay. Back up, back up, back up. Here we go. Okay. Okay. Oh god. Okay. Back away. Back away. Back away. Use this. Use this. Use this. Uh, right. We need to grab a. Need to grab a pain pill as well. Use that. Okay. Yeah. Definitely the. Uh... Ready? Another bleed. Get out of here. There we go. Okay. Need to reload. Oh god. Okay. Okay. I was, I was lucky. Lucky we got a reload on him. Yeah. The rider remover is very very handy here. Okay, so this thing is reloaded now. Okay, let's back up this way. Got him. Is that it? We got him now? Yep, they're all gone. Whew! Okay, there we go. Got rid of those little buggers. God, those are nasty, aren't they? Those those guys are nasty. They are not fun. Right. That's how it cleared out. I didn't even level up from that. How dare they? Right. Oh! Back up, back up, back up. Okay. Because there, no, no, me, she would step on that mine. Okay. So this guy's fine. He's just a feral. We can get rid of him. There you go. And use another one of these. Man, they need to lower the bleed chance on these guys. It's way too much. Okay. Let's get rid of you. Gotcha. And we level up. There you go. And we now have four skill points to spend. So let's go for strength nine. There you go. Oh, I think I heard a bird coming in somewhere. Actually, wait, are we? is our strength being sapped right now because of the heat? I think it is. Yeah, heat will sap strength until... until yes, yeah, so this has actually lowered our... Um, yeah, it's like lowers our pack mule and everything. Um, so yeah, stupid heat. Okay, let's come up here quickly. Uh, right, so now I can actually... Okay, let's add a, a couple of extra extra stuff here. And Oh, there's actually a bit up here as well now. Didn't even, didn't even realise they added that as well. Okay, let's go and... Um, Right, where's this bird? So yeah, they've actually added a little bit extra to the top. Right, let's get rid of that first. And then we can open these. See if they actually have anything good in them. Something tells me there's probably not much good stuff in these. Looks like just cabinets and stuff. Yeah, nothing great. Oh, that's a shame. Well, there's a sink that might have ammo in it. Uh, nope, I had a wrench in it, but no ammo. So... Where's this stupid bird? I don't know. Oh, there you are. Oh, of course. They're, yeah, yeah, then fly, then fly away, you coward. Get out of here. Okay. Uh, let's hack through this. And then there is some stuff up here. Here we go. Nice. So here is where the uh, here's where the good loot is. Let's have a look and see what we can find here. Nothing there. Anything in here? We have gold and silver, some iron armor. I guess we can repair it and sell it later. Yeah, we can. Yeah, why not? We'll repair it, sell it. 
Um, because that's handy. Um, more money is always good. So there's a passing gas box here, which has some wheels in it. I'll take those. Not worry about the electrical parts, though. So some working assist boxes and a shotgun messiah box. So there's four stone in there. I'll take that. Uh, a hammer in there. I'll just leave that one. We can just scrap it. Uh, an AK in there. There we go. And loads of rounds. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, there we go. That's that side all done. Okay, so let's go ahead and drop down here. And then there's another section down here as well, which also has some more boxes, etc. Down here. So there's one working assist box here. It has an iron shovel in. We can probably sell that for a bit. Okay. Anything in here? We have another iron shovel, which I'll scrap. Chemical parts, which I'll scrap as well. Right, so this bit... Hang on, is this bit safe here? No, it's not. Okay. Also drop in here as well. Oh, and there's a, there's a rad down here. Okay. Good thing that there's only one of them. And good thing that I can just set them on fire and kill her gradually. There we go. And stay out. There we go. What have we got here? So you've got a wire tool. And just sell that. You've got forged iron and an iron garden here. I may as well grab that. We can keep that. Uh, pickaxe is not very good. So yeah, any high quality stuff we'll keep. But other than that, I'll just get rid of the uh, the lower quality stuff. I'll just get rid of. And in here we have absolutely nothing. Okay. Um, does this stuff still have 6k health? It does. Uh, yeah, so I was like, well, 5,000, but, you know, close enough. Um, so it still has a lot of health on it. Okay, we can get rid of that bit there, and then we can just frame our way out of here. So let's make a few more of those. So one, two, three, four. Eight frames, that should do. Uh, wait, did that just make really quickly? Oh, no, it didn't. It was, um, I was waiting for that. Right, there we go. Take that, and then take that, and then we can jump out. One, two, three. Four. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, it looks like they have ad adapted the uh, the building site just a little bit um, for the new for the new alpha, which is pretty cool. I like that. I like that they've made a slight adaptation to it. Uh, oh god, really? God damn it. Okay, hang on. Oh. Okay, there you go. Now I can come back up. Okay, we are getting uh, we are getting very very hot here as well. For lack of, uh, for, the, for the heaters, uh, it's sapping our strength. So we're going to need to go ahead and have one of those. Because that's going to be, uh, otherwise that's going to be draining our stamina like a huge amount when we try and get off of this thing. Uh, right, so let's jump down here. Right, so now I've got to be even more careful here. So this land, they've, they've made it so this landmine holds on like everything. Oh man, this is, this is a, this is not good, is it? Okay, let's go around here. There we go. Okay, good. Right, we're on. Right, so this time we don't have to worry about that, so I can probably just run and drop to that. Uh, oh, hello. You weren't here before. Okay, I guess there's some more sleepers that we have yet to... There's one more, a couple of loose ends we have yet to fix, so let's go ahead and see if we can get rid of the rest of these. Any more sleepers here? Nope. Okay, run across here. And then we can make our way down. Slowly but surely. So we can drop to that one. And then there. Oh, hello. Knock him down. Oh, that was a good that was a good shot in the face. Okay, come on. Got him. There we go. See, we can't get strength nine yet. We need to get out of the hot area and then we can. Then we can purchase it. Okay, oh there's a uh, thing here that I never got. Oh hang on. Is there anything up here? It's like it looks like there's, there's like a way here. No, there's not, okay. Anything in here? Gas barrel, I'll take that. So good for selling. Alright, uh, where do we go from here? Uh, down here, isn't it? There you go. Drop down there. Drop down there. And then we can get off of this thing. Alright, drop down here. And what do we have down here? So we have a couple of builders. Is there any a couple of them here? Oh, there's a guy up here as well. Hello. Oh, you fell off. Nah. Sucks for you. Okay. And then I fall down here. Ha! Because I'm good at falling. Right. Right. You get down. Nice. I love setting these guys on fire. There we go. Get these guys out of here. Oh, and there we go. There is the building site, guys. So yeah, that's pretty good. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the, the new building site and how it how it looks now. So that's really, really cool. I'm glad we explored that one because it was a nice little interesting place to uh, actually revisit from the old alphas. Now, there's also the fire station here. Considering we haven't been in here yet, and we've not looted one of these um, in this entire series. We've been past a few of them, but we've not looted one. Let's have a look. Let's see what we get. Never know. Okay, my water is like super low right now. Oh, I've already got footballers running at me. Okay. So that is a problem. Well, they were not getting as hot right inside here, but yeah, water is an issue right now. Because, you know, desert biome. 
sapping uh, like everything, so yeah, water is a slight problem. But that's okay, let's go and see what we can find in here. So yes, down it is going to be an issue. Let's go and drink a coffee right here and we'll eat one of these, which also increase hydration too. And then maybe we can get a poncho here, hang on. Maybe I can get... Um... Oh, there's rads in here as well. I see ya. I see that. Okay, we got... Okay, there's a couple of regulars here. So there are some radiated ones here. Okay, so now we're no longer overheating in here, which is good. There you go. Right, so there is a radiated one right in the distance over there. Got it. Okay, missed. Missed again. Right, where are you going? She's going to run around this way, isn't she? There you go. And again. Let's keep getting this as much as we can. There you go. So we'll weaken her a little bit before she comes to us. Okay. Now she'll see me. There you go. Knock you down. That'll stop you recovering. And then we'll get a couple of hits on you. Gotcha. There you go. And down she goes. Excellent. So radiator one is dead now. Anyone in here? Nope. Any more rats in here? Let's have a There's a couple of gun safes in here as well, which is good. Uh, business food right here. Come here, you. Nice. I wonder if we're done his own because I got him in the face. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if he burns on his own. Will he burn to death alone? I don't know. Nope. Still going. Okay, fine. Nice. Made him do a complete flip. It looks like as my strength goes up, also, I like it. It's like when you hit them, you hit them a lot harder as well. It looks really cool. Um, okay. So, can we now get strength 9, um, which will allow us to go to here? So, I'm guessing strength 10 is 5. Yeah, so 5 points for strength 10. Man, that gets really expensive as you go up. So, yeah, 5 more levels. So, 5 more levels. So, increase minimum blood damage by 40%. So, yeah, once we're at strength 10, we can get the last uh, We can get the last of all these perks and everything as well. Um, I also want to get this one as well, but I think we're going to we're gonna rush for strength 10 if we can um, and get that one sorted. So, I need another one of these. There we go. Drop that, and let's go ahead and clear this out. So we'll open these boxes. There's a couple of gun safes in here as well, and gun safes are always handy. Reminds me, I didn't actually get the gun safes back at the other shotgun messiah factory, but that's alright. I don't really mind that so much. If we uh, if we're gonna go and get those, I'd rather get those. Um, I'll get them separately. It's fine. Yeah, lots of our cam stuff to do as well. So you know, I still gotta still gotta clear a few things out here. Let's open this one up and let's see what we get in here. This one gave me steel arrows and just pretty much just crappy ammo, so nothing great in there. Disappointing. Anything in here? Uh, nope, just jars. Okay, and then there's another gun safe right here, so let's go and break our way through there as well. Doing slightly more damage now with uh, with our strength, which is awesome. So let's go and break through this one and see what we can find in here. Hopefully, we'll find something good in this one. All right, so in here, what do we have in here? We have another burning shaft mod. We'll take that. Um, and I guess what we can do is install it on one of these. Yeah, let's uh, let's make it a proper fire axe. Let's go and modify this, and we'll make it an actual fire axe. There you go. There you go, guys. We now have a fire axe, like literally a fire axe. Mwahaha! Now I can now I can make them all burn. Okay, so there is this guy here. Nothing behind it. Always check for stuff behind here, just in case. Okay, anything else here that I want to grab? There's a vending machine here. Uh, oh, actually, vending machines could be handy because we can buy coffee from here. There you go. And we can also buy uh, raw meat from there. We can buy ears of corn from there and taters from there as well. There you go, we'll buy all that. Very good to have. We've also got golden rod tea again. Very good to have as well. So we might as well buy all that up. Um, and then we've also got the box up here right there's one working stairs box up there if i can get to it and there's a claw hammer in there okay so that's a cupboard not too worried about that let's gonna have a quick look in these that's just a toilet that is what is that another couch okay nothing good uh this one another couch and that one is a construction supplies box oh no gun okay i'll take that yeah, I can't repair it, but I'll take it in there. I've got one up. That'd be good for when we're actually building our day 28 base, I guess. Because, um, unfortunately, we did lose our other one. And it was a really good one as well, and we lost it. Um, okay, so cooking pot in there. Not really worried about it. Not really about that, worried about that either. 
And a grill. Hmm, okay, this place would be really good if we found a button grill. That'd be awesome. That would have been awesome. But we already have one and we don't need to worry about those for now. So that's all good. I'm gonna search this car real quick as well. Uh anything in here? There is one short iron pipe in that car. Okay. But yeah, now we're at strength nine, guys, which is absolutely amazing. So that means that we are all good to uh to get the last few levels needed for strength ten. So how many so yeah, I've got to level up five times um to get that. And then after that we can then purchase the uh the one I really want to get is that last extra Tyrannosaurus perk. I really want to get that one, because that means then that every time you make a killing blow, we get fifty stamina back. Which is which is insanely OP. It's really good. But I think we're at a pretty good point to go and end off the episode, guys. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. So until then, bye!